Buckingham body language. While we can't read the minds of the royals, turns out their bodies have plenty to say. And that's especially true for the Fab Four, William, Kate, Meghan, and Harry. We turn to relationship and body language expert Katia Loazel to find out the real meaning behind their royal moves. Our body language, our facial expressions, that's actually our first language. Megan's body language may be the most openly expressive of the royals, but what she's saying about that baby bump, she can't seem to get her hands off of. She's very affectionate, she's very tactile, and that is very much seen in the way that she interacts with her unborn baby. There have been thoughts that perhaps holding your bump is a sign of arrogance or a bit of a show, but actually often this is a really subconscious protective mechanism that a lot of mums adopt, and that's really a sign of pride. And while mom-to-be is projecting pride, new daddy Harry is a little, well... He's nervous about this baby. He has become more anxious. And when that happens, we often use uh, reassuring gestures to calm the anxiety. You might see him hold his jacket. It's called a paperclip hold, where you have the hand over the jacket with one finger slipped underneath or on your tummy with your hand underneath your jacket. And this is a way of reassuring oneself. And we've noticed a lot more of this type of behavior since Megan has become pregnant. And Harry's anxious tendencies might even be growing on his wife. Megan's recent New York trip was really interesting from a non-verbal perspective. Being away from Harry in the limelight was almost like a fish out of water. We saw this real vulnerability that we actually haven't seen with Megan. Her shoulders were raised. Her head was ducked in a turtle dive. She was using her bag and her hands to cradle, but protectively in a very tense way to cradle her bump. Her clutching and holding onto friends and linking arms was a sign that she needed support. Megan still got a few anxieties in England too. Megan's quite nervous around the Queen and she giggles. We see a lot of self-soothing with her brushing away her hair. She's far more submissive. She's waiting for the Queen to lead. And finally, the Megan and Kate rift. Rumor or real? Absolutely rumor. Based on their nonverbal communication, Kate and Megan are in sync. The year before, Megan was literally clutching quite high onto Harry's arm. It was more about the couple rather than the group. Now this past year, the Fab Four were walking down almost exact same shot. Rather than being glued to Harry for support, she was actually closing the distance between herself and Kate, both of them actually leaning in towards one another. It's not for the cameras, it is genuine. And make sure to check out lovedestination.com for courses on how you can learn what your body language means and then how you can use it to improve your relationships and maybe even find love.